Now we're staying on top of developing news this morning that contaminated water link at the former Piney Point Phosphate Mine of US 41 in Manatee County. An evacuation order remains in place. ABC Action News reporter Larissa Scott is there live now with how this is affecting homeowners and businesses in that area. Good morning, Larissa. Yeah, good morning, Avery. It really is. Hi, good morning, Dia. The mandatory evacuation zone right here is affecting more than 300 homes and several businesses in Manatee County and as crews work around the clock to prevent a potential catastrophic flood. While officials were more hopeful yesterday after being able to increase the amount of water being pumped out of the most unstable retention pond into Tampa Bay, the county says they're not out of the woods yet. The governor ordered more pumps that will arrive here today to try to get as much water out in an effort to prevent a total collapse of the gypsum stack. While we want while we wait to see how well the controlled release works, several businesses on US 41 have had to close until further notice and people who live near the evacuation zone still can't get home. It's a scary situation. We just came off of a horrible year with COVID um, and it you know basically destroyed the restaurant business throughout the nation and in Florida. Uh, just when you kind of get things going again for something like this to turn the corner to, it's pretty disheartening being business owners. The officer that was um, uh, patrolling the area would not let us through because he said he had orders um, of not letting us go through. And I said, well, wait a minute, but we're not in the zone. He says, well, my orders are not to let anybody in. Here's another look at the evacuation zone. It hasn't changed since Saturday evening. If you haven't left yet, officials say you need to go for your safety. We have this map for you on abcactionnews.com. On our website, you'll also be able to find the very latest details and we'll, of course, keep you updated on all the newest developments out here. Reporting live in Manatee, Larissa Scott, ABC Action News.